Hey guys, before the video begins, I have an announcement for you. After the Timothy error, it is with great sadness that I will be retiring from the error series. The reason for this is because, one, they're not fun anymore, and two, I there's only so much you can do. Like, I try to do something different with each error I make, but... I've just officially run out of different things I could do with the error series. And when I look at errors and I look at mine, like mine is like basically a real person while the others are like from Go Animate or Beyond. And let's be honest, who wants to listen to O O O O O O O O O O H H H H H all day? I certainly don't. So yeah, that's why I used real voices rather than um Vyond or Go Animate or whatever or Voice Forge or even you know, but yeah, I'm. I know I said there was going to be a season five, but you know what? I just don't enjoy doing errors anymore. I'm just gonna retire. So I hope you all understand. And if you end up enjoying this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. And without further ado, let's get on with the video. Greetings. My name is Jason Sheeran. And I want to welcome you to my 10 Nights of Halloween. <laughs> Finally, Halloween is upon us. Let me get my costume, and I'm going to call up my friends, and we're going to go to that Halloween party. Oh no, not another blue screen of death. Not when my Halloween party is near. Ah, let's just get this over with. We interrupt your Windows XP session for A. Hey, Jason. How are you holding up? Thomas, what are you doing here? This isn't a Thomas Error 4, is it? The good news is, no. The bad news is, this is something far worse. Oh, right. The Timothy Error. I completely forgot about that guy. Well, is tonight the night? Unfortunately, yes. You are going to have to prepare yourself because this... It's going to be the scariest error you've ever seen. But we can always defeat him together, Thomas, couldn't we? I'm afraid you're on your own this time, Jason. For some reason, he wants you more than me. I tried to confront him, but he said that I was no longer his concern. So whatever you did, you better be prepared for consequences. Okay. It's time to get rid of Timothy once and for all. So whenever you're ready, Thomas, you can bring in the error. All I can say is best of luck, buddy. Timothy error. Timothy jumped off of a viaduct, killing him, his driver, and fireman, and everyone on board his passenger train. Since there are 31 days in October, this error will contain 31 chances which will expire in 90 hours. Do not turn off your computer, otherwise Timothy will get mad, and if you waste all 31 chances, you won't like the end result. And also, one more thing, you need to be careful, because you only have one good chance until Timothy goes into his evil mode. That's right, if you turn off your computer even once, Timothy will go right into his evil mode. Now I'm off. Well, you know what, Timothy? I don't care how many times it will take for you to go into your evil mode. I am going to keep turning off the computer no matter what you say, whether you like it or not. You have done a lot of bad things to my friends, and you are going to pay. You should never have done that, mortal. Wow, the narrator really wasn't kidding when he said you were going straight into your evil mode. That's, That's right, because, because you turned off your computer for the first time, I am now in evil mode. I will be in evil mode for the rest of the error, and for every five times you turn off, I will go into a scarier evil mode. Now if I were you, I would please not turn off the computer again, because if you do, a time reduction will occur next time. I really like where this error is going so far. I'm going to turn off the computer again.
you turned it off again, which means a time reduction has occurred and it is now 85 hours and you have 29 chances left. Please don't do it again or else you will make it even worse for yourself. Alright, this is the third time you've turned off your computer. Because of this, another time reduction has occurred and it is now 80 hours and you have 28 chances left. Please stop this. Really? Fourth time already? You are starting to make me very angry right now. If you keep it up, hey, I didn't finish my speech. How dare you interrupt my sentence? That's it. The timer has been reduced to 70 hours and you have 26 chances left. And if you turn off your computer one more time, I will go into my second evil mode. This is my second evil mode. This is what happens when you turn off your computer six times. Another time reduction has occurred and it is now 65 hours and you have 25 chances left. I'm tired of turning off the computer. You know what? I think I'll just block the screen instead. I hope this works. Hey, it worked. I'll have to do this for a while until the Timothy error goes away. Oh, here's a shocker. It didn't work. Hey, how dare you block me? That counts as a turnoff and I need to see you. You now have 24 chances left and the timer has been reduced to 60 hours. Well, if blocking the screen won't work, I'm going to try putting my computer on standby. Standing by your computer also counts as turning it off. Well, you know what? I'm going to try something else. I'm going to try restarting my computer. Restarting your computer also counts as turning it off. Sorry, but rules are rules. You now have 22 chances left, and the timer has been reduced to 50 minutes. Well, I've got one more trick up my sleeve. I'm going to try breaking the computer screen. hi -ya! Breaking the computer screen counts as yet another turn-off. You now have 21 chances left, and the timer has been reduced to 45 hours. I have fixed your computer so you can never break the computer screen again. And if you turn off your computer one more time, the background will change to brown and I will have black eyes. This is your warning for the third evil mode to come. I told you, I would be in my third evil mode. This is what you get for turning off your computer 11 times. I am now very furious with you right now. You now have 20 chances left, and the timer has been reduced to 40 hours. You know what? I'm going to try changing the chance count to 20,000 and the timer to 400 hours. Hey, it actually worked. You are not allowed to change the timer or the chances. That also counts as turning off your computer. You now have 19 chances left, and the timer has been reduced to 35 hours. No freaking way, Timothy. There's no way that that counts as a turnoff. You are a stupid tank engine for saying that. Calling me stupid also counts as turning off your computer. You now have 18 chances left, and the timer has been reduced to 30 hours. You know what? Screw this. I'm just going to turn off the computer again. I must warn you, the more you turn off your computer, the scarier and scarier I will become. You now have 17 chances left, and the timer has been reduced to 25 hours.
You know you're just upgrading me right now. If you turn off your computer one more time, I will have white pupils along with the black eyes. You now have 16 chances left, and the timer has been reduced to 20 hours. Yep, that's right. I am now in my fourth evil mode. This is because you turned off your computer 16 times. You now have 15 chances left, and the timer has been reduced to 15 hours. If you continue these shenanigans, you will be done for. I've already told you 16 times not to turn off your computer, and yet, we're still here. Another time reduction has occurred and it is now 10 hours and you have 14 chances left. You are not listening. Now you only have 13 chances. The timer has also been reduced to 5 hours. Each time you turn off your computer, I progress myself to look more scarier. This is getting worse each time. The more you turn off your computer, the scarier I will become. You now have 12 chances left, and the timer has been reduced to 2 hours. I am warning you. Okay, you know what? That's it. If you turn off your computer again, I will be in my fifth evil mode. You now have 11 chances left, and the timer is now one hour. Ha! Huh, I scared you. That's what you get for turning off your computer 21 times. I am now in my fifth evil mode and the background has changed to black. The timer is now 50 minutes and you have 10 chances left. Still refusing to listen, I see. Now you have 9 chances left and the timer has been reduced to 40 minutes. chances away from having to suffer the consequences. If you just wait a half an hour, you can get your computer back. And trust me, it'll be a lot faster than turning off your computer eight more times and wasting all of your chances. Look, buddy. All I ask is for you to wait 20 minutes to get your computer back, instead of wasting the 7 remaining chances that you have. Is that too much to ask from you? Yes it is, you stupid silver engine. What did you just call me? I called you a stupid silver engine. And a Thomas knockoff, too. First of all, Brewster from Chuggington is a Thomas the Tank Engine knockoff. And second of all, how dare you call me a stupid silver engine? That counts as a turn off. You now have six chances left, and the timer has been reduced to ten minutes. And if you turn off your computer one more time, I will go into my dot exe mode. So you better not do anything bad. You will die by my buffers. Look at me right now. I am now Timothy.exe and the background has changed to fire. You now only have five chances left and the timer has been reduced to five minutes. If you just wait, then you can get your computer back. <laughs> Chances, and the timer has been reduced to one 
minute. If you just wait a minute, literally and figuratively, you can get your computer back. It's not that long. <laughs>
Okay, um, what do I do? How do I get out of here? Uh, uh, oh, oh, poor guy. He needs my help. But what can I do? Wait a minute, I just took on three diesels. A simple steam engine couldn't be any harder. Yeah, I'm gonna go help him. I'm coming for you, sir! <laughs> Still not a match for me after all these years, I see. He may not be a match for you, but I am. I told you to run, kid. A warrior never runs from a fight. And I have something to tell you, Timothy. Oh yeah? And what's that? I acknowledge you. You... You what?! You heard me. I acknowledge you. In fact, I respect you. I think you're a pretty dangerous dude, and you have a very dark backstory. Uh, I, I... But if you ever want to get on the road to redeeming yourself, you have to let that stuff go and put the past behind you. He's right, brother. You gotta let go of that stuff from the past because it just doesn't matter. The only thing that matters is what you choose to be now. Please, Timothy. I'm begging you, let it go. No! I will never let it go! Jason, get your friend out of here. I'll hold off Timothy. But what about you? Just go! Timothy, it's not too late. You can become a redeemable character if you just let the past go. No, Thomas. Jason will pay for his crimes if it's the last thing I do. It's over, Timothy. You can't win. I already have, Thomas. I am Timothy, the unstoppable ghost train. And I am Thomas the Tank Engine, Sir Topham Hat's number one. Wait, what are you doing? No, stop! Wait, wait, no! All right, you, explain yourself. When I was your age, I too had to deal with these computer viruses. What are you talking about? Who are you? I'm you from the future, and I've been stuck in this computer world for 30 years now. 30 years? That's a very long time. How have you been surviving? I've been forced into hiding because Timothy's been trying to kill me for years, and I can see that he attempted to kill you as well. But now that Timothy has been defeated, we are finally free from this cursed place. Yeah, you got that right. Hey guys, what I miss? Thomas, you're alive! But where's Timothy? Don't worry about him. He's in a better place now. Jason, did I forget to mention that I'm also the narrator? What? No, you're not! Um, yes I am. Okay, you're clearly on helium. Excuse me, chatterboxes, but I would like to give you a ride home if you don't mind. I would like that, Thomas. So would I. I hope it's not too late to get a college education. Well, hop on board then, and I'll take you home. And with that, Thomas the Tank Engine took the two Jasons home. Will you stop doing that with your voice? I'm telling you, I am the narrator. Ugh, whatever. But anyway, thank you all so much for joining me on my 11 nights of Halloween. And also, thank you so much for watching The Timothy Error. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. And until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. So long! <laughs>